Hi, I'm Joel Topsick from Broadcasting and Cable Magazine. We're talking about how you can prepare for the digital television transition. In this segment, John Taylor from LG Electronics will provide a demonstration of over-the-air digital TV and walk you through the installation of a digital-to-analog converter box, which will allow you to watch digital broadcasts on an analog TV. I'm thrilled to be here today to talk about the digital-to-analog converter boxes that will help consumers make this transition to digital television. You know, millions of Americans watch analog TV today using an antenna. This is a 10-year-old TV that uses an analog antenna, and as you'll see, when, as you watch the various channels in analog, it's prone to snow and ghosts and interference. Just flipping through some of the lo local stations. Some come in better than others, and you can adjust the antenna. We've been doing this since the dawn of television. What digital brings, though, will be a crisp picture, like a DVD quality picture. And let me show you how we set that up. About three dozen digital to analog converter boxes have been certified by the NTIA. This is the Zenith box, one of the most popular ones. This is available through Radio Shack, Circuit City, and lots of other retailers. A very similar box will be available through Best Buy. When you get it home, first thing you'll see when you open it up is a quick setup guide. Ours is in English and Spanish. Very simple way to show how to hook it up. In addition, of course, it has an operating guide, again, in English and Spanish. Uh, the box itself is a handsome little design. It fits most decor, very simple to use, which I'll show how to install in just a second. And it also has included a remote control, including the batteries, as well as all the cables you need to hook it up, an antenna cable, as well as audio-video cables if you'd like stereo sound. Connecting your new converter box is really simple. Probably the biggest challenge is turning the, your old analog TV around so you can get to the to the antenna inputs. Now that we've turned the analog TV around, I've plugged in the converter box. and Let me show you how easy it is to hook up. First, you disconnect the antenna from the television set and connect it to the antenna input of the converter box. Next, you take the antenna output from the converter box back to the antenna input of the TV. The same way we've hooked up a VCR for the last 25 years. If your analog TV has audio jacks for stereo sound, the converter box will provide that as well. So all you need to do is hook up the stereo cables to the left and right output jacks of the box, to the left and right input jacks on your TV. Then you'll have stereo sound. Now that we've hooked up the converter box, I've turned the TV around again, and let me show you how we scan the channels. First, you turn on the converter box. Turn on the TV, and you want to tune the TV to channel 3 or 4, just like a VCR. First thing you'll see is an, a quick install guide, a welcome screen and you just kind of walk through the process. I'm going to choose English as my language, but this box also has the menus in Spanish and French. To search for channels, you push a button and this will go through. Remember, this is receiving digital broadcasting through the same antenna that this old TV used to receive, the analog broadcasting. So right now, it's searching for the new digital channels. Searching for the digital channels takes under a minute, and in our case, we found over 25 digital channels available. From here, you have a crystal clear digital picture. Remember the snow, the ghosts, the interference we had with the analog signal? Now that the digital signal is coming through the same antenna, through the converter box, you get this nearly DVD quality picture. Not only is it a better picture, but you get more programming. So that's it. Your digital to analog converter box is really easy to set up, so you're well prepared for the transition to digital television on February 17th of 2009. Thank you for watching.